Welcome to day 10. You know how yesterday ended? Somebody made a comment last night. Oh, you finally swept the floor. Oh, I did? No, not you. You're oh, okay. <laughs> pretty, no, in the body shop. It's usually a mess. And I did. I, <laughs> I swept I about a, <laughs> I swept about two thirds of it and then uh, somebody else finished. We had a serious conversation about it. Yeah. And I kind of finished it. It's about the details. Isn't this, isn't our whole world about the details? Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. So what do I do? I go to the glass shop today. We reject this yesterday because it was too thin. I went up there, said, make this better. So what do we do? We get fiberglass resin all over it. And instead of wiping it off with acetone, now I gotta give it to poor Eddie to sand, but I'm not gonna do that. I will go DIY form it myself. <laughs> so it's about the details. Okay. So it's about the culture. Is it not about the culture? Yeah, I guess so. You're a cultured guy, right? Uh, I don't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm starting to like the culture around here a little bit better than what it was, though. Are you not? I've always been here, so I <laughs> <laughs> You come into this this little room here, this area. This is the Eddie room. It's like, there it is. The culture has pretty much been the same in this room since I've known you for maybe, what, 30 years now? Oh, a long time. Oh, somewhere in there, yeah. A long time. Got stuff hanging there, work. So. But I might need it. You <laughs> might. <laughs> no, but it's, it's not cluttered, and it's it's kind of cool. Remembrances of some of the old stuff, plus yeah. the pattern. So. We got Mike's car. Yeah. Mike has uh, sent a pattern. He's a wise guy. He's in a wise guy's seat. That's what I. That's what I showed you. The yeah, with the armrest and stuff. With the armrest yeah. in the middle. Yeah, usually I make them, but you know if he wants an armrest and stuff, he might have to buy one because you wouldn't have the right mechanisms, you know, to make it fold down. And, and uh, I can put it on the hinge where it just flops down the bottom of the seat, and then it might not stay up once you put it back. You know? Well, we'll we'll get over and look at the look at their stuff. Okay. And then you need to get with him on the. All right. What it's going to be. So you're doing the wood. This is Mike's car though, right? Yeah. I walked by here last night and said, oh, there's a bunch of wood piled up, so it must be <laughs> must be for this one going in. I brought in the kindling. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta do some whittling. I, I gave you two grill shells yesterday to get done. You got one done and rejected one, and I yeah, got another yeah. one here. But... I got it all ready over there, all the, all the... Did you get them tops done we had? Yeah, they're over there. All right, awesome. Yeah. We're moving on that. I can't wait to get going on yeah. some of these other turnkeys. Not, not all that went fishing in between, so you know. Yeah. <laughs> now I'm gonna head over to the. I made my rounds in the bottom in the glass shop. Oh, did you? Yeah. Yeah. So my day starts with the. Yeah. <laughs> not happy. No. No, that's. Uh, but I'm happier. Normally happier than you are. I, my 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 normal. Here's our normal routine. I come in. How you doing? Or good morning. That's it. That's it. Yeah. Good morning. And I'll say, what's good about it? And your immediate response is, what's good about it? So that's our general start of the day. So here oh, I am. No, we're on the green side of the earth. We just got to be happy. We got to be happy. I'm yeah. going to be happy no matter what. Sometimes he comes in with the camera and I just kind of walk off. <laughs> Something's aggravated me. Uh, <laughs> you know yeah, sometimes. So anyway, here we're starting DIY day 10. Yeah. I'm on the 40 day challenge. And I want to start working on some of these turnkeys. I can't wait to actually start working with you so you can tell me what to do. Give me the look of like, no, we need to do it like this. No, we work pretty good together. Oh, yeah, we always I mean, have. We can. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so. <coughs> well, yeah. one thing about it, when we get in there, we pretty much both know what we're doing. So I, you know, we don't talk a lot, stuff. actually. Uh -uh, we just no, get it's in there like, and do okay, it, yeah. here, here's the tool you were needing. I'm uh, over here now and yeah. doing Yeah. 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 Every once in a while, you're in my way. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> no, not. No, you wouldn't be blunt. I'm sure you wouldn't be blunt. Yeah, we we get going on something. We can go pretty quick on. So there's a lot of folks wanting their cars, and I don't blame them. Yeah, it's been a long time, but I've been saying it before, and I'm going to say it again. You can't do 100 hours worth of work in 20 hours. Right. Yeah. And if you do, it looks like you did in 20 yeah. hours. And it's hard to find anybody that even have an inkling of what we're doing. I, I mean, it is, I've, I've come to that conclusion. Yeah. We're, we're going to get the culture the way it needs to be. It's yeah. about the details. Yeah. It's all about the details. Yeah. This well, is yeah. BS. Yeah, it is. You're living a reality show. This is my reality this morning. I'll yeah. get it posted tonight, and y'all can relive my reality. <laughs> yeah. So, and yes, Robin, we are going to work on the Midas Touch car. We're going to work on all of them, but and yeah. we're going to DIY them. Right. 
And how many how many think we get done in the forty day period? I don't know. If I get out of if I, I get out I of just, the, two or three of us, you know, we're still no, with well, Daryl and and you and myself mm -hmm. focus on turnkeys. Yeah. I'm gonna have to work on everyone. We're gonna have to go over and make sure what parts we need, what we don't. So when yeah. we start, we're going. Yeah. And uh, I think by the end of this week, the body shop's gonna have to be. I'll just go visit the body shop. Go visit the body shop. Visit yeah. the body shop. I won't be the body guy, yeah. the main body guy. So at least the floor swept in there. Yeah. Well, can't say that for mine. <laughs> but well, you're, you're, okay. This is work in progress. But when I came in, I heard this thing going. Yeah. So there you go. Which I had to repair this morning to pull the wheel out of it. <laughs> I got it going. Okay. Well, you've dominated my video for today. You oh, okay. Five minutes and forty-seven seconds. Well, what a deal. Yeah. That's, uh, are you going to? Evansville, you got that on your plans yet? Not yet. Okay, so when you go to Evansville, August 2025, <laughs> make sure you come and look up Eddie. It's going to be fun. I'm, I'm going to go in a couple weeks. Well, you just, just have to keep looking. <laughs> so, Evansville, Indiana, 2020, the 2049th anniversary is this year. Yeah. Might so find gonna, somebody who looks like me, but yeah. it won't be me. <laughs> I'm excited to go up there. So anyway, I better get excited about getting some work done. All right. So it's about culture. So we're actually able to just scrape most of this off. I said earlier, if you don't sand it, it's got that uh, pre-release agent still on the part and uh, nothing will stick. So most of that fiberglass didn't stick. So what I'm gonna do is go ahead and sand it now. But you can see around this slip, I and mean, that's not straight, that's not clean. So I'm gonna go ahead and sand that and kind of give you a, a shot of what it's supposed to look like. Other than that, we've been doing a lot of sanding on all the rest of the cars over here, so we're, we're doing that for now, too. We're going to give them the DIY. Oh, okay. Would you rather they do this at home? You knock these out pretty quick. How long does it take to do one of these? Oh, about an hour and a half, something like that. Okay, so we're. this is what we want it to look like when it's done. Looks pretty good. Got the grill in there. Take a couple of these guys. Which are pre pre drilled. I actually think we probably sell it as a kit, and then you're gonna have to cut them to size. These are stainless rods that are how long? 19, 19 and a half. 19. So these need to be 19 and a half. Uh huh. And you just sand them. Yeah, because we cut them with a cutoff wheel in there. And see, they leave a pretty good burr on them, and they won't, so they won't stick through the hole. In there. Yeah. Like so. Like so. And it's fine to ride the same hole, but they're all crooked. Hey, it done good. So you load them all up, stick that puppy in here. So, yeah. are you going to notch these down over here where they yeah. go? And then five and a half space in between each one right here. Five, five and a half, half, five, half, five, and half, half five and a half, half in between. Five and a half. Okay, so then it, it kind of cuts into here a little bit. Yeah. And this could be sanded and. Uh, Cleaned up then, cleaned up up behind it. But there you go. That's what we look like. There's 36 of these little jewels. Okay. In between everything else, it's after lunch now. We talked to Mike. Mike actually texted right after I. Oh yeah. Did the video this morning. Yeah. So he's gonna. He sent some pictures. Uh, he's gonna. This is like. Uh, and you talked to him for a little while. Yep. Yep. So we got it figured out. Uh, I think so. I told him to send me some more pictures. I think I can drop them into the video right here. So he's going to check on uh uh, leather for his seats. On the Here leather on for the so seat. we need to yeah. know how many hides does he need? Yeah. How yeah. many? How big a? Well, it depends on a lot of times they'll they'll tell you what they are, how many square foot. You know, you just kind of figure from that. And this last one we did, I think we got. Didn't we get three hides? Three the hides. Well, you're, point, you're pointing over here. What am I looking oh. at? <laughs> a pile of stuff here. Oh, so that's some of the leather. That's some of the leather that was left. But it wasn't much. Here, just a little bit on the roll, and that's scraps. A lot of times, you can't really use this little stuff out here. Well, this is real leather. This isn't. That looks leather. like, feels like, smells no, like. No, it's not fake leather. It's real leather. So it's a hide. It even smells good. Yeah. <laughs> so it's a hide. 
So yeah. how many how many square feet do you think it needs? I don't know if I go by yards. <laughs> oh, okay, how many yards do you think it needs? Uh, ten, uh, yards uh, ten yards for the car. Ten yards? Ten yards. Ten yards. So Mike, you're watching this, you got it. No, ten headliner, yards. The headliners and the, that's what I told him to. Oh, so he knows. Yeah, he knows, yeah. So if you're doing this at home. All the way around inside of here. Ten Close yards. And he's a wanting a console, but there is no room. How wide is it? Well, we talked about it. From here to here. Well, about that wide. About that wide? <laughs> how wide? <laughs> Not like this. There you go. So you got from there to there. 45 and a quarter. 45 and a quarter. And then by the time you... So like an aspen back seat if you want yeah, the bench seat would fit or time you get your interior in it you know which you might as well get talk about the inch it'd be about be about 44 and a half something like that time you have your, your panels and everything here you know all right might so a, carav a caravan would be the best 44 caravan would probably work too yeah but you also got to note that these cars they yeah, they, they go yeah, down. Narrow as they go. In the they kind of narrow down to the bottom. Yeah, in front of the seat, it sits about right here. So see, it's only it's only 39, 39. across there. Yeah. And outside of the seats, hits the door, you know, when you shut it. All right, so he's a... Now, Mike's an aircrafter. Was an aircraft mechanic or worked on aircraft? Oh, so he was, huh? He's pretty tight. He's pretty... <laughs> yeah. Tolerances are close for him. And I guess it's going to be a show car, so yeah, everybody can't win, but we like to win at least with one of our cars. Yeah, he said he's going to show it for a while, but he's going to drive it, and that's a good thing. Well, good. Yeah, he's going to drive it. Well, you've dominated today. you got another four minutes here. That's eight minutes and five Holy minutes, cow. nine minutes. Yeah. i got some sanding. Did, we, just, did, we did a lot of sanding on bodies. But yeah, we're just windy today. <laughs> we're windy. <laughs> yeah. So I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to wrap my video Maybe I'll show you those primers at the end of the day, or maybe not. Yeah. You'll find out See, at the end of Now, really, when I'm talking, I ain't having to work. So. <laughs> <laughs> and there's a nice, cool breeze coming in I, the door. Me, so, yeah. Man, <laughs> look at Does that make you feel cool? Look at that coming in. <laughs> Woo! All right. Well, folks, it's a hot breeze. I guarantee you. Yeah, it is a hot breeze. Yeah. So you're cutting here. Yeah. I mean, I'm just bonding. You got anything bonded in yet? No, I ain't bonded nothing in. I cut it all out and then start bonding. Okay, so yeah, I'll put another... I'll put another one of these right here, and my panel will come around to it. This okay. will be flat, and then we'll make your it round over too there. Fast. I'm trying, I'm making everybody oh. dizzy trying to follow okay. your hand around. Anyway, <laughs> little brace here. Uh, my panel will come around here. Okay. Stop here, and there'll be another panel across the back, and another one will go the same there. And then the, the roof panel. What did it do with it? Oh, it's up here where can you see it? Oh, you bond those in there? Glass them in? No, no. that'll be the, the real panel. Okay, so then you're just going to wrap these? No, they'll they'll mold to this. Oh, so you will bond them in? And then, yeah, this this will be up against the glass here. Okay. See if I got the right one. Probably not. Why well, no? Close enough. We get the idea. Yeah. Anyway, they'll they'll go in here like this. And then you wrap that. But I'll have it. Up to the glass. I'll have it molded to this, yeah. and it'll be uh, see pretty much one one big panel all the way around here, and the material will, will roll into this. All right, it's not going to be custom; it's just going to be factory. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, see, it'll go in there like that. A one of a kind factory. Yeah. One of one. One of one. Because each one of these are different. See, it'll go in there like that. And I'll trim and make it nice up around there. So if somebody was going to attack a poster on their own, what would you say? Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> I'll start with one. Don't start with leather. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What, what would be your number one advice? Uh, From an outsider perspective, here's what I would say. Right here. Get a machine that does the work. Can you do it if you did sign a regular sewing machine? No. No. Nope. Time you got your half inch of foam and the thickness of the vinyl, and you know it's you can't do it on a regular machine. I believe you. Yeah. You I don't can. think you're just making that up. You think I'm just making that up? No, I, I don't think you are. Uh, okay. <laughs> so if, if you want to do your own upholstery, definitely look around. You can probably find a used machine. 
Yeah. I mean, it's still pretty good. I've got good. another one over there in the corners. Oh, is it your it's machine? <laughs> is it for sale? No, it's a backup, huh? Yeah. Well, these machines are how old? These are like older than you probably. Yeah. Well, I learned on that machine in 82. That oh. very machine right there. And was it new when you got it? When you no. were learning? No. No? <laughs> no. So a good machine will last a long time. We had a salesman used to come in and look at that thing and said, it come over on the Mayflower. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but it still works. Oh, yeah. And I'll still remember every time I look at it, the time you stuck that needle right into your finger. Yeah. Didn't you know, clinch, just rolled the thing up and pulled it out. It felt better when it quit hurting. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that's, this is definitely the end of today's video. So I'm, I can just go to work now. I don't need to worry about more. Oh, you're going to work? You're actually going to do something? Hey, uh, you see Bondo on there? Oh, okay. All right. Is it somewhere? Okay. All right, then. <laughs> All right, I'm good.